Sign of the Times episode 468 with a very disclosed QT, folks. Oh. And I-5. Oh. Yes, I-5 right behind us at this very undisclosed pick a neck table. An undisclosed pick With a hole table. in it. Oh, yeah, there is. I spotted that off. Now, right QT, do you have many picnics along I-5? No, I, I, I pretty much fear these places very much. I can understand that. They could be dangerous. I sense serial killers have walked here. I wouldn't doubt it. Yeah. I know they go up and down I-5 here sometimes. Woo. Yes. Yeah. Now, QT, you have some coffee. Oh, that yes. coffee comes from the Demon and Bunny. Oh, Demon and Bunny. Okay. Great coffee. Why don't you go ahead and try it I and see what you it. think. Okay. Ooh, I, I think I... I have a hint of salamander and blueberry. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Right off, I graded a bee. That's not a bee. bad. Yes. You know who loved it? Who's that? Chicken Bob. Oh. He had some last week. He loved it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he loved it. <laughs> now, you got me this from the 7-Eleven. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You know, that's actually um, 18 when you think about it. Okay, yeah. some eleven, yes, yeah. eighteen. The lid uh, is on there, but not bad. Oh, only okay. in dark roast. Dark roast, yeah. yes. It might be even still warm a little. It bit. is kind of warm yeah, a little right? bit, yeah. How is yours? Warmish. Warmish. Okay. Lukewarm. I got a brand new mask. Oh, it's oh. my love boat mask. Oh. Look at that. The cast of the love boat, at least the original cast in animated form. Wow. Now, can you sing us a little bit of the Love Boat theme song? I forgot that. Time has stayed... Uh, I, I can't remember the Love Boat. You can't song. remember how it starts off as love, exciting, and new? It, it's a, it's aboard, expecting, you? expecting oh, you? Oh, okay. Now it's starting to seep into my consciousness. You want to hum a little bit of it? With the Love Boat. <laughs> <laughs> JB Moonshine T-shirt. Ah. J.B. Moonshine will be on a week from tomorrow. All right, a he's, week. Yeah, we think. He's penciled in. He should be on for Hockey Day. We, oh, we hope. Hockey Day. All right. Yeah. There is a picture of Evan Sullivan autograph. He's got uh, Mark Lewin and Gary Hart with him in that one. And he's looking on there like, I hope QT doesn't ask me about the Florida Keys too much. Oh, all right. Yeah, Florida Keys, yes. There is what it looks like when John Lennon hung out with Paul Freakshine. I think John Lennon sang the Love Boat once. Uh, he might have. Was he ever on there as a guest? I don't think so. You know who was? And Ringo this, Starr. He might have been. There was an episode, Sonny Bono guest starred, Damn. and he played basically a knockoff Gene Simmons. Oh, he did? He came out with the makeup and the tongue and I have fire. got to see that. And he was like tired of being this character, and he wanted to play like lounge music. And his agent was like, you can't do that, all the money's in this. He's like, I'm tired of that. And he threw it all away for some girl he'd known for a day. Wow. Millions and millions. Like, ah, I've known this girl for 24 hours. I'll just throw all my money away. Yeah. yeah, that's how they rolled on their love boat. Yeah. It was when you could stalk someone for 24 hours and they would marry you. Yeah, it's it frowned upon in 2021. Well, Sonny Bono was a catch, from well, what I hear. Yeah. Cher didn't think so. Uh, probably not. Yeah. There's Paul and his freak show. All wonderful Zach Winter. Now, do you listen to Wonderful Zach on the Darkest Island? No, I, I've just uh, broken in on full jugular. They're beginning to recognize my number. Oh, wow. Yes. <laughs> There's Paul and his niece, Casey Carlisle. Paul and, I, Paul and I have always seen eye to eye. Oh, wow. Yes. You can get pictures like that at CaseyCarlisle.com. That's CaseyCarlisle.com. Oh, we got a holiday coming up. We do. It's upcoming um, Easter. Ah, uh, yeah, Easter, yes. Yeah, you get some of those for Easter. Oh, yes, a large title bill. Yeah. If you're old enough, you can get some of those. Risque. Yeah. That would be good on the love boat. It would. It really would. She would have been perfect as a guest star on the love boat. Maybe the love tugboat. Maybe. Remember Tugboat Taylor? Oh, yes. There she is with the guana belts. There she is a little bit sultry. That would have been a good one on the love boat. 
Now, imagine if she wore that on the love boat. Gradu Gopher would have fainted. Graduating, uh, yes. Gopher, yeah. yes. Doc Gripper would have been hitting on her if she was like that. There she is if you're smaller. Smaller, yes. There she is with the pillow. My favorite. Yeah. She would have went to Julie McCoy and said, I need a nap with my pillow. And she would have taken her up on the deck and had her sit down in a lounge chair. Right between the funnels. Yeah. The, the funnels. Now, if she showed up like that, probably Isaac would have made her a martini or something. I don't know if she likes martinis. but Bartender, I'll take a triple yeah. gra grasshopper. Maybe. Uh, cream, could, cream and ripple? Yeah. We can find out if she likes grasshopper or cripple. Cripple. Yes. There she is with the wall of belts. Mm. Wall of belts. A little bit angry there. Oh, yes. Here's there other you. members of Team Bad News. Not one single good news. Troy Miller. There he is. He was just recently back on the show for Music Day. And he has the tough quit answer. He had the tough answers. Yeah, he did. Ooh. Look at this. I brought my... Let's see. Where is that? Oh, no. I oh, gotta, oh, here we go. Look at that. A picture hey. of QT. Or smart. Made out to QT, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. There's my autograph picture of Seymour Smart. Yes. Proud member of the Gallagher roster. There's Ken Hammond. Now this used to be a hotel, and that's where Ken Patera and Mr. Saito were arrested. Wow. In a brawl with the cops. They threw a rock. Just like Ken Hamlin is in this picture, right through that door. Man. Ken Hamlin's like, you arrest Ken Patera, you arrest me. And he tried to throw it right through there. I'm just glad he made it back safely with my postcard. Yes. CAC program. CAC got moved. Got moved to, I believe it's September this year. September? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Long way away. Yeah. Long well, way. Well, it's been since last May that they had one. Yeah. Well, not even that. In May of 19 is when they last had it. There is what it looks like in Stephen P. News office. If you gotta sue, the law office. see what you knew. Facebook, Instagram, the YouTube, which they may be watching right now. Try to be now, probably. But watching. not literally. Well, they literally are watching it. Oh, on okay. YouTube, yes. But you can not <laughs> follow me literally. Because that would be creepy. It would. Yes. Yeah. I hope Dexter Loomis is hearing that and realizing. There's a pamphlet for the Silent Times. Ever show me the pamphlet? Romania, yeah. yes. They have wrestling in Romania now. Yes. It's a sister promotion of OVW. Yes. Car Carpathia craziness, I think. Maybe. I'm going to give that book to Petrov if I ever see Petrov again. There's a 19 and 3 quarter percent chance I'll see him again in my life. Boy, oh, okay. He might be setting up a hut on the river. And just fishing out of his house. Uh, the Columbia River, maybe? Yeah. yeah, I can see that. He loves to fish. Yeah. I wonder if he's ever salmon fish. Oh, I'm sure he has. Yeah, salmon, you would yeah. think so, yeah. Yes. Fingerling salmon. Yeah. Fingerling. Yeah. Now, Beast Barnett and I, we reviewed an episode of Car 54 recently where they went sword fishing. Ooh, sword. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. They had to do a complicated amount of trades of shifts to get to go sword fishing and then the guy that was going to take him out they wrote a ticket to him unknowingly and he had to go to a traffic court so they ended up having to rent a rowboat to go out sword fishing rowboat yeah Jeez. look i got for you out of the little free library Whoa. look at that for those for those unexplained moments where a guest don't show up or bail yeah which they is very rare Guinness. yeah now are you are you looking forward to reading that? Well, let's see what we got here. Oh, okay, Peter Allen Nelson. Okay, um, erratic director. Okay, he sleeps with his ex-wife. Oh, wow. Or something like that. Very nasty mob connections. Oh, this oh, is wow. up my alley. Okay. And, very good. Book I'm about to start reading. It is The Gamer Place. Oh. Yes, David Lopez. We had him on the show. He's Boo Sullivan. Ah, he's not writing books. Mr. Boo, yeah, yes. Yeah, Boo Solomon wrote this. I'm looking forward to reading it. Took me a while to get to it, but I'm on it now. Looks fascinating. So I think he enjoyed our questions. I think so. I can't remember what I asked him, but... Well, maybe you asked him something about um, video games. Oh, all right. Oh, all right. Yes. Yeah. Well, this week we're busy. Sunday. You know what we have going on? Game show! Yeah, we're doing game a game show. show. You and Randy Zeller is going to be playing the part of Alex Trebek 
and apparently um, the new host, Ken Jennings, and you'll be asking the, or you'll be given the answers. Beast Barnett, Shark Payne, Stevie Jonak, and Y Barry T. Pierre Jones will be guessing the question. Now, do you have an early prediction of who's going to come in second? One of the three of them. Uh -huh. Ah, yeah. okay. Yes. Now, there will be prizes awarded, so it's a fierce competition. I hope Lance Dean doesn't try to knock out Shark Payne Jonak and take her place. You know how he is. Oh yeah, yes, he's a he's a thumb, thumb breaker when yeah. it comes to uh, prizes. Yeah, he yes, he, he's obsessed with the thumb for some reason. Yes. Now, Monday, pretty much free. free. Okay, it, you're so, we're probably going to have an atmospheric river, maybe up to four inches of rain locally. Oh wow, that's a lot. Yes, that is a lot. Tuesday, not much going on. Wednesday of this week, Beast Barnett and I are going to review an episode of Chips. Oh, Chips, yeah. okay. It's a punk rock edition of Chips, apparently. Zane Paisley found it. <laughs> Beast and I are going to review it. Oh, now are you going to give your opinion of this over a radio show? Well, maybe. Like Full Juggler? Uh, I don't know if it'll be on Full Juggler, but All right. probably on the Twitter we'll give our opinions Twitter, on the episode. Okay. Eric Estrada started chips, you know. Oh, okay. Yeah. Larry Wilcox did most of the run, and then he dropped out. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Then Larry Wilcox, nobody heard from him except cameos when he was coming back as his chips character. Uh, okay. Yeah, that was a poor choice on his part. Really. Yeah. Thursday. Maybe a hot coffee. Yeah, I could go for a hot coffee. On Friday next week, we have... I forgot. Trent Nitro. Oh, yeah, Trent Nitro. He's yeah. out of... Florida primarily <laughs> wrestles in North Carolina coming back from a broken leg. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, maybe you want to ask him something if we've done rehab. Yes, or, or how his patellar is doing. Yes, okay. yes. Or his patellar in the shoulder. No, patellar's in the knee. Oh, right. knee. Yes, I believe he broke his uh, femur. Yes. But okay. to review, yes. as we you know, drink some Let's coffee. Another, another sip of this one. Okay. Not bad stuff, is it? Ah. Yeah. Now, Sunday's the game show. Game show. Are you going to wear a suit to host it? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to be wearing next to nothing. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> They'll look I, forward to that. I bet Sharpane Stevie Jonak will at least wear a top hat. <laughs> All right, okay. Monday, I got pretty much nothing. Nothing. Tuesday, you're also pretty slow. Yeah. Wednesday, you might buy me something to wear. I don't buy my. Should I go all natural? I, the, the fans are calling for it. Maybe. Don't forget. Chips. Uh, chips, yes. Yeah, review them. Yes. Thursday? Uh, you might get a hot coffee. I have this. Yeah, there's 7 Elevens here. Not that good. Yes. Uh, Friday? Yes. We are getting. Our guest is not going all natural. No. <laughs> Nitro. Nitro. Going yes. to be fully clothed. That's yeah, a wise choice. Bottom. Wise oh. choice. All right, I, I'll show up fully clothed, I guess. Full oh, <laughs> Maybe a strategically placed burrito. Large burrito. Chicken? Chicken. Chicken Might burrito. make him nervous. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Well, pretty much 468, though. Yes.